This is Bonnie Forest, a county reserve that lies in the border of Garissa County, Kenya. It covers an area of 1,399 kilometers square and is managed by the community of Garissa County, assisted by Kenya Wildlife Service in Ijara Sub County. It was considered for gas settlement in 1976 by the national government as a dry season sanctuary for elephants in the former Kenya Ijara district. The Boni Forest Reserve is an indigenous open canopy forest and part of the northern Zanzibar coastal forest harboring densities of plant species that are among the highest in the world and the forest has been declared as a biodiversity hotspot. Boni Forest have common herbivores which includes buffaloes, hibos, bush pigs, wild ox, common diggers, toby, water pigs, gazelles and herolas. The common carnivores in the reserves that include the African wild bees and many other species that never be seen in the world. As part of East African coastal forests, it holds bird species including the globally endangered species, especially Sokokwitis. It also holds the most endangered antelope species, Herola, that lead to the establishment of the community-owned conservancy, Ishakbin, to protect these precious antelopes. Every year, the number is coming down from year to year. The Kenyan Forest Act 2005 established in 2007 in the context of its general principle provides for the establishment including the conservation and rational utilization of forest resources for social development of the country. The Act recognizes the importance of the forest for the benefit of soils in ground, water regulations, agriculture and their roles in absorbing greenhouse gases. Historical forest that provides both food and shelter for the community is one of the most Kenyan forests that really deserves a lot to be protected not only by the government of Kenya but the community itself. The Boni Forest serves as a shrine and a religious practice site for 100 years. The forest is the single largest natural resources for Garissa County. It also serves a haven for pastoral communities during the dry cell. It holds some spiritual significance for some other community because in every eight years the historic Maradero spiritual gathering is conducted in the forest. Kila maka nane. Maka nane, tunangia hiyo mstuni, tulachinja, ngombe, arbaini, na watu ya dini ngombe moja na kumi na ina dume na wale watu ya dini arbaini 40 years old 40 people wanasoma hapa wana wanasoma na sisi tunaenda kuomba ndio mliona sehemu hii hata wakati ya shifta haukuweza kuingia hapa the forest provides for the community with food honey fruits and also a medicinal that really guarantee a substance for life for the community living. The little known bony forest has exceptional biodiversity consisting of most variety ecosystem that provides rich for mammals and many other species. Since the exception of the devolution, the county government inherited all the resources, assets and liabilities and management of the defunct county council to that effect undertook following measures that really had results to be protected. The forest and the mining peel and the wildlife, energy and environmental peel are some of the measures that the county government have put forward to safeguard the indigenous body forest. The deployment of conservancy managers and the county environment officers for cooperation is one of the most important activities that the county government has put forward to deserve and preserve one of the Kenyans most indigenous and protected environment. We have council lahai or municipal council lahai Harusu Rija County Garissa. Forest can uh forest and majara forest ka gas a count house a matha not the gas a count on a scale. Not the gas a count on a capacity. Uh Marba no in Madden, the Makas of Dark Forest. Gas a count to Madden, are a full tone, especially half twenty fifteen. I would say one building on a forest, a county forest. 
Therefore, the government of the forest was done without the constitution, according to the Kenyan government and the county government of Garissa. The government of Boni Forest was done in contrary to Article 10.2 of the constitution. Following the dramatic turn of events, Garissa Senator Yusuf Haji narrated the historical importance of Boni Forest to the community living in Ijara. Our community land, ni hile ambao watu wanafanya umanisho, kuna shrine na mambo kama hiyo. Hataka kuhakikishia kwamba wakati muli safiri sahi, hamkuona uombe, kabla muliona kanga na mbuzi. Uombe yetu yota sasa hiko kwame, jiko huku. Kwa ya kwame. Kusema ya kwamba hiyo forest itakawa control na forest Ni kusema ya kwamba na iteni kisu la leni itawachinja Hiyo ndiyo maisha yetu maishimua Maisha yetu ni hiyo Hatulimi Sisi hatula kilimo Hatuvui samaki Maisha yetu ni mifugo War of resources between the neighboring countries Which will rather bring a problem than a solution. This is need to be protected. The government of Kenya tried to gasset the Boni Forest, a livelihood for community of the Boni Forest and the surrounding community, a system that they say it's a complete disenfranchisement and a complete marginalization by a government of its own. In another na emotional narrative, Mama Mariam, a local resident in Bodai, narrated the importance of Boni Forest to the community. Wakati forest hawaishi hapa ijara, ndio saini hata tunatunga hapo ijara poli poli forest. Tangu wao wamekuja kuishi ijara, kukuja hapa kufanya kambi ndio wameharibika hata boni forest. Wamekufundisha hata kitu ambacho sisi hatujui thamani. Tulikuwa tunachunga sana hiyo ijara boni forest. Ni wao tu wanasoma mtu chini wanaanza kwenda kata hiyo kwa hosa huko na miti yote. Samani tulikuwa tunaishi, yani tunaangalia sana hii mnyama ya msuni na hiyo yani ijara boni forest. Tulikuwa tunaangalia sana sisi ni watu wa amani. Hata hatutaki moja iliwe kwa nyama ile iko ndani. Na tulikuwa tunaangalia sana na macho. Forest wametuletea shida sana hata ningependa nitoke kwa ijara forest tuangalie sisi manyewe. Kama sisi serikali ni mzuri tuangalie maslahi ya wananchi. Lakini leo ile tumeona watu wa ijara ni wafugaji, ni watu ambaye wanachunga wanyama. Kama ulimwambia wetani wa wanyama hao iwezi kwenda kwa Boni Forest. Jameni hii watu wataenda kuishi wapi? Tunaomba serikali as soon as possible haraka haraka tufanye digazetment ya hiyo land. This needs to be corrected. This need to be degasseted according to the leaders that converge at the Jara sub county. That is our livelihood. We are setting that land will affect us socially, economically, and uh, legally. It is clear from what you show today the people of the Jara never, never ask for the gazette on this land. And for a civil servant, a public official to sit somewhere and cause that kind of things. I think as a committee, you need to recommend strong measures against such a public officer for the future prosthetics of this country. We have recently uh, known, came to our attention that the Kenya government, the national government, has gazetted what we call the Boni Forest, where I am currently. I am currently in the midst of Boni Forest. And uh, to be very frank and to be very sincere, uh, this is a forest that the people of this county, the greater people of this county, really rely on it in terms of, in terms of forestry, in terms of livestock rearing, and in terms of even farming. Of course, we do small-scale farming uh, around this forest. This is something they say is just a knife in the back that needs to be reconstituted again and needs to be protected if at all the government is caring the well-being and the welfare of the society.
this is an epitome of success as far as devolution is concerned. A road construction right from Asaladi, Kara, Kotile, Abalatiro, and of course, Bovai, a 70 kilometer road construction worth delivering the livelihoods of the residents of Northeastern, especially the Masalani residents.